What's good, YouTube? Dre here with Different Gaming, and we got our boy Carlito on the channel. My man's been ducking and dodging the camera, <laughs> but no, no, he be in the lab. He he don't like giving out his deck list. Like he like to keep it to himself. You know, let the team know. So, Carl, you know, introduce yourself and tell them what deck you gonna be running. My name is Carl Camacho. I play in Greensboro, and today I'm playing a Top Hat every Tuesday. Uh, today I'm playing Tempa. I've been playing it for the past three weeks. Got Top 8 in a case tournament. Uh, the deck was a little bit uh, different than what I've got right here. I just modified it after the tournament, but this is what I've got. Got one Dora, one Mac, three Pyja, three Chundra, Two Goku oh, no, we died. and two Fodra or Fodra. Uh, this is all standard except for this. This, uh, I see a lot of people playing up more than one. One is fine, it's not really necessary. Uh, past turn one, and then standard spells field spell three, and then three quick plays. <laughs> Oh, that's just standard. Uh, extra standard card just for Tempa's Prosperities. You can't go wrong with that one. This shit's gonna go to one. It's gonna get hit eventually. Uh, for the second engine. This isn't just Tempa. This is <laughs> Kistira Tempa. I just feel like this is necessary for pushing for easy kills. It's an uh, easy way to win. And the turn one inboard is actually a lot stronger. Uh, this is actually just perfect for fodder for the field spell. Just in case that ever pops up. Okay, okay. For the hand traps. Got three Droll, three Ash, three uh, Imperm. That's it for hand traps. Would you change any other hand traps or keep it like it is? Right now for this format, I, I believe it's just, should stay the how it is. Um, I've got Board Breakers. I've got three Book of Eclipse, two Regeki, one Harpies, and two lightning storms. Uh, this went insane over the weekend in uh, Euros. And I understood why because uh, every other turn or every other board is mainly just an Apo, uh, something generic, uh, like an SP, and then maybe a Fenrir. All of them get broken by uh, Regeki. Unless they're made with a uh, Mascarena, of course. And that's okay. it for that for the main deck. Uh, would you like for the side or extra? Uh, you choose. Okay, for the side, it's link package for SP. It's, uh, Seals Pass, uh, Princess, and Hito. Uh, last second for the case tournament. Uh, switch to Samurai Destroyer for Doolittle Camara, and I miss Doolittle Camara honestly. Doolittle Camara, I didn't realize the line for it, but all it is is just make those two monsters uh, link over or link it off, or link those two monsters off. Okay. Make Doolittle Camara have the quick play spell. Uh, make a Q belt after you've done set your uh, your field spell or have your field, uh, field spell active you just pop the field spell and you push for game that's so easy those are the sevens here's another one uh this one does not come up much but i'll see it in everyone's list so i'm, I'm going to stick with it uh my favorite black rose it just wipes the whole entire board easily uh Two summons is nothing for this deck. Especially with the quick play spell, especially with uh, 
the field spell. You can just add the Genroku and keep playing. Mm. For the other sevens, we got two of these. Fighting. <laughs> He's perfect for going first if you're going to make a seals pass with the extra bodies. So you have to play two. And then here's two. Two of the big boys. The big boys, uh, I just got scared of Tempo or Kastiras in the case tournament. And actually for a while now, I've been scared of uh, Kastiras because if they out one of these, then I'm really having to play around a, a way too much. Um, I'm having to play around like super polys and stuff like that. This is not ideal for me. So, uh, if one gets sniped, they usually they usually will go for one and then uh, try to attempt to go for the second one. But that's it for that. Here's uh, another level 10 and then trying it. This one's important because right now you can uh, you can hit Fiendsmiths. You can hit Snake Eyes. It, actually, Snake Eyes hardly ever cares. Um, you can hit Ritual Beast, not that bad, but it doesn't affect them that well, that much. Not really sure. Uh, top decks that I hit with this card. I've hit Galaxy Eyes over here. I've hit uh, Melodious with it. I think that's it. Uh, Trident, you just have to play, it's just for easy uh, win button. And that's it for the extra. The side. Two nib. Two Lancia. Three Heat Wave. Two Cosmics. Two Barriers. Shifter. And Drago. Uh, Anything you would change in the side? For the sod, I might cut this just for the uh, spooky dogwood. But any, any, everything else, I'd probably uh, keep the same. Okay. Cool. We finally got Carlito on the channel. My man's been putting in work with the Tempai Dragons. He he even smacked me on on, on camera. So. Yeah, don't do that. I got smacked up a couple times uh, with my own deck, though. Oh, yeah. But thank y'all for tuning in. And until next time, y'all, peace. Have a blessed one.